July 13th. What has God wired you for? God not only created each person on earth with a distinct design, but he also placed in everyone a unique vision. No person can give you this vision. It is only God given. You can go to as many seminars as possible and receive all kinds of wonderful instruction, but no one except God can give you the idea you were born to fulfill. The poor man, the rich man, the black man, the white man, every person has a dream in his heart. Your vision may already be clear to you, or it may still be buried somewhere deep in your heart, waiting to be discovered. Fulfilling this dream is what gives purpose and meaning to life. In other words, the very substance of life is for you to find God's purpose and fulfill it. Until you do that, you are not really living. You need to make sure you can say at the end of your life, as Jesus did, it is finished, John 1930, and not just. I am retired, for your dream is much bigger than mere retirement. Jesus said, for this reason I was born, and for this I came into the world, to testify to the truth, John 1837. You must have a clear reason for your life, as Jesus did. I know what mine is. I was born to inspire and draw out the hidden leader in every human being I meet. If you stay around me long enough, you'll start being your true self. Why? I was born for that. I was wired for that. What has God wired you for? Prayer, Father, what have you wired me for? I am one of your children whose vision is still buried in my heart. Please draw it out so that I may see it and then fulfill it. In Jesus' name, Amen. Thought, fulfilling your vision is what gives purpose and meaning to life. Reading, Psalm 7-9, Acts 18.